Hello, and welcome to You Matter. In a minute, I'll be introducing you to the lead facilitator for this course, but before we begin, I wanted to let you in on some of the amazing benefits this course has to offer. We have all been experiencing tremendous challenges over the past few years. Not only have these challenges changed the way we live our day-to-day -day lives, but they've also brought with them a deep need for self-care, something that many of us find ourselves struggling to create for ourselves, especially when we spend so much of our time and energy making sure others have all they need to be healthy and well. This course is an amazing opportunity to push pause, to focus on your own self-care and to connect with other like-minded and caring colleagues. Let's take a look at what other participants have said about this course. You Matter provides a much needed sacred time for our own selves in the midst of the heavy work we do. The amount of education provided in the time frame allotted was very impressive and effective. A game changer indeed. We do matter. Thank you so much for giving us the opportunity to connect with other mental health professionals. And early data, just two months from pre to post changes, shows the following. Those reporting significant burnout decreased from 53% to 33%, and those who reported having significant compassion fatigue decreased from 42% to 33%, all in just a matter of two months. And I'm also excited to share that 78% of participants showed much or great improvements in their ability to practice a healthy lifestyle. And 78% of participants also showed improvement in their ability to learn from stress or challenges. And 72% of participants said they had much or greatly improved in their ability to bounce back from stress. Wow. This You Matter course not only changes how we look at and deal with stress today, but also helps us learn to embody practices that will influence our health, our well-being, and our wholeness throughout the rest of our lives. And now, I'd like to introduce you to You Matter's lead facilitator, Dr. Joel Bennett. Hello, everybody. My name is Dr. Joel Bennett, and I am the lead facilitator for this upcoming course called You Matter, Well-Being, Self-Care, and Resilience. I'm so excited to provide this course to behavioral health providers, therapists, counselors, those working in the trenches to provide mental health support and related counseling. This course, which is uh, sponsored from Acadiana Area Human Service District, the Louisiana Department of uh, Health, Office of Behavioral Health and the Women's Foundation is a rare opportunity to just take some time out for you. And uh, my organization, OWLS, Organizational Wellness and Learning Systems, is so excited to provide this kind of support to you through very simple practices that really are just about taking time out to be with each other. So I'm gonna explain a little bit about what the course is about. And um, after this is over, you'll see a information on how to sign up, you know, how to sign others who work with you or for you uh, to sign up. Um, the, the whole purpose of this course is, as we all know, the uh, results of uh, the COVID pandemic, uh, political strife, uh, uh, a number of factors associated with social uh, stressors has really placed significant demand on the resilience of behavioral health providers. In fact, in just the past six months, the federal government has issued millions of dollars of grants to help the social support infrastructure of behavioral health providers. Um, our work is all about moving from stress to resilience to thriving. And in these three 90 minute sessions, you will have a chance in a very short time to learn some of these skills. Uh, the first session will really about, be about understanding the differences between a hassle, a challenge, uh, adversity, and trauma. A lot of times when we, as a provider, and I myself am a provider, uh, 
because there's so much going on, it's hard to discern, is this really raising to the level that I really need to stop and take care of myself? So that's very important. But the goal in that first session is to understand that every one of those is an opportunity for not just having self-care, but learning how to grow through that process. Um, another significant aspect, which we dive into a little bit more in session two, is how to create the supports that you need internally and externally, especially if you're dealing with burnout, uh, secondary trauma, and compassion fatigue. Um, and then the third session, you will be learning practices to extend and continue to do some support. We are very strong on connection, uh, making connections. There'll be lots of opportunity to talk with each other, have an opportunity to share and learn and grow together. And you also receive three books as a result of your registration. Uh, the first book is our book, Raw Coping Power from Stress to Thriving, which has very practical cognitive behavioral tools for transforming stress. Uh, you also will receive heart-centered leadership uh, I, as a, a friend to the behavioral health industry, believe every therapist counselor is a leader. And very often we don't stop and understand the virtues of being a leader and how to tap into those. So that's the second book. And then the last book is our book called Your Best Self at Work, which speaks to itself. So this is a very positive oriented training. Um, and I cannot thank uh, Acadiana, Office of Behavioral Health and the Women's Foundation for taking a step forward to help those who often don't get the help that they need. We're so busy, we're so tired, we're so exhausted. This is a break, <laughs> this will be a break. If you read the books, great, if not, it's okay. It's all about just giving you the support that you need. In fact, you'll get a special surprise care gift. Uh, so, I look forward to seeing you and meeting you. I should mention that we will collect anonymously uh, baseline data and follow up. So you'll be able to see your progress um, and learn where your gaps are and really come up with a plan for ongoing self-care, ongoing resilience, right? And the recognition that you, you do indeed matter. Thank you, I hope to see you. 